And here in the east, some towns are beginning their 4th of July festivities today. Out in Bellhaven, the town kicked off its second day of 4th of July festivals. People there are enjoying more than 25 vendors, live music, good food, and so much more. Today's event featured a cornhole and horseshoe tournament and a mutt meet. We're the longest um, town with um, running 4th of July this year is our 80th year. Um, so that's more so why we're going a four day event and usually normally just two days, but we're going to four, trying to make it big, something different um, for our 80th year. Celebrations will take place there until Monday. Tomorrow there will be gospel singing, firecracker dancing, and a concert on the waterfront. Also celebrating the 4th, the town of Oriental is hosting the final day of the 42nd annual Croker Festival. The festival featured live music from local bands, a parade, and plenty of vendors selling food and handcrafted items. Event planners say this is the first time they've held the event since the pandemic. So pulling it up um, after two years um, was, a, was a challenge, but uh, I like a good challenge, so... We got it. It's here. A fireworks show is set to kick off tonight at 915 over the waterfront there. And along with all of these celebrations, there's also many other festivities around the East. If you want to find an event happening near you this weekend, we've made things super easy for you. Visit WNCT.com and find Let's Go Out under the Features tab. You can find an interactive map there to find fireworks shows nearest to you and a full list of July 4th festivities.